Hit the boosters! Hello friends, my name is Brandon Dayton. I am your humble narrator. Welcome back to Grav. Today I am uh, doing the base building as promised in the last episode. I don't know if I'm going to go that crazy with it. But I definitely want to uh, see what some of this stuff do. Open multi-story contiguous room. Yes, that, that seems interesting. I'll go ahead and build one. See what happens. How about it? Is it something that I want to do? I don't know. Let's see. Oh, it is nice and open. How nice. So if I build one on the other side, is it going to have a window into the other room or is it going to break down that wall? That would be the question. Let's do another one. Mm-hmm. Wood room with door. Yeah, I'll probably need to uh, build another ramp or something like that. So let's see what happens with that. I think it'll break down the middle wall. Yeah, that's so nice. Can I shoot out my shoot out my door? Out my window, out my window. Um, a little further. I guess not. That's all right. Still kind of nice. Let's see. Uh, there's nothing in here, so I'll self-destruct this thing. Destroy the base item. Yes. And I should probably build a, a kitchenette or something like that. I think that would be rather fun. Uh, force field, power relay, floodlight, low planets, beacons. Hmm. Here. This is what I want. Oh, look, he has little mustache. I like that so much. And I'm probably not going to use it uh, straight off, but... Pretty cool. Got my, uh, my e-butler, or whatever it is. <laughs> and, uh, now I need my armory. Let's build some more ammo. Assault rifle rounds. How much ore? Yeah, alright. That ain't too bad, I guess. Stack it up. Stack it up. Stack it up real good. I really like that, uh, assault rifle. So I want to make sure I have plenty. And how about shotgun shells? I think we're kind of good for this. Yeah, we have 924. That'll kill some shit for sure. 1750. Oh, oh. It says only 133 of the combat shotgun. But that's okay. I ain't too worried about it. Uh. Get them. Get them real good. And uh, I logged out and back in and I still seem to have my plasma sword so that's a good thing um, but what did I need a radiated ore in order to get my my next what you call -ems. boom 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 yeah so I don't know if I need to go to a moon for a radiated ore or or what's the deal hmm Probably have to hit that generator one more time. Unpowered. Yeah, of course it is. It's been on for just a little while. Oh, but I need this. Control click. Divide the stack. We'll give it 20. No reason to go crazy now. Thank you so much. Boom. I love my frog feet. Alright, so Desolate Moon, Sinister Moon, Callous Moon. I think Forsaken Moon sounds like a good idea to me. I am uh, a bit low level, but that's okay. We'll get it figured. Hooray! The Forsaken Moon! Do I need any more uh, plasma? I guess not. I have quite a bit in the inventory. And I have a lot of gems as well. We need fossils, we need wood. I need to hit some ore up to see if I can get some irradiated ore as well. I don't know if it drops from these or not. Quite, uh... No, these are contaminated ores. Hmm. Where did I get the irradiated ore from? Probably from a, a low-level world or something like that. But I'm also getting, uh... A little bit of rank every time I mine some stuff, so 
I guess that's all right. I'll get my hunter levels up. Couldn't hurt. Why not? And I love those jackpots. Jackpots always nice. Mmm. And like I said, the 20% uh, jump height with the boots is extremely good on these uh, moon levels. Because you get 20% more. And 20% more of a bigger number is uh, even more. Or something like that. Oh. Hey, buddy. What you doing? What am I? I don't like that too much. Let's, uh, let's switch it up. I can kill this thing way faster if I go astronaut. Although I do need to, uh, unlock some different jobs if I hope to get all the blueprints. Kill him. Kill him dead. Well, there's a blueprint right now. Constructobot. Hell yeah. Reduce cost of base items. That'll be quite nice. I find this agreeable. How about combat shotgun? Yeah! <laughs> it's always so good. Oh, man! Hmm. I don't think there's a, a whole lot for me to do on the moons at the moment. There's a, a bunch of goodies, but... Hmm. I'm not in so much need of anything aside from fossils. So I guess I'll focus on fossils for just a little bit. There's one over there. There's one right here. And I can hit that jetpack, at least for a little bit. It's not going to do me uh, too much good, I don't think. But I use it. I got at least a little, uh, a little wood. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Mare Chrysium. I don't know what any of that means. There's Bane elements, and there's, uh, whatever standard elements, I guess it would be. What the element of the moon is. I guess it's ice. Is that right? Am I understanding this correctly? Probably not! I don't know what you're trying to tell me, Grav. Most of the time, I don't. But then somehow I get it figured out. It's like a, a magical, mi mystical miracle. Of mysticalness. Uh, Alright, we'll hit this. Keep an eye out for some more fossils. Or something like that. And I guess I could get some plasma as well. Couldn't hurt. Alright, watch out. Watch yourself. Don't get none fall damage. Oh, there's a little bit of fall damage. An acceptable amount of fall damage. Mm-hmm. Give me all this. I need it all. Come on now. Combat pistol. Hey, buddy. Yeah, I was definitely doing uh, a bit more damage with the machine goons. But this ain't too bad. I'm liking that. It's pretty nice. Plasma, and then we'll get that, uh... That fossil over there. And I'm not taking any damage from the, uh, moon quite yet. Which is pretty cool. This plasma suit is doing me some wonders. Gotta keep sticking with it. At least for now. Until I find something a bit better, or understand how the, uh, ow. <laughs> how all the ores and shit like that. The different ore armors have different elements within them. So, uh, I guess you'll take less damage or do more damage to the enemies. But, uh, I have yet to play around with that. I've only got one ore armor at the moment, and that is the, uh, what you call it? electrical one which doesn't seem like it's gonna have an effect on this moon because this moon is ice and fire element but I think it'll be a, a good thing to play with especially for lower level classes it's gonna come in quite handy and I'm really amazed that uh, I'm still not taking much um, much damage from the atmosphere here pretty nice We'll just keep the plasma and fossils coming until the point that I have to leave. Which I'm sure is coming soon. But I don't even see the, the little breathing thing yet. No lungs uh, pointed out on my UI. Which is pretty cool. I like it a lot. Maybe we could stay here forever now. I just live on the moon. Oops. Oh my. Okay. That's fine. Thanks so much. <laughs> 
Oh, and here's some, uh, some nice pumpkins. Hello, pumpkins. I'll get some wood while I'm here, too. That seems like a good idea. Always need more. Especially since I did do, uh, a little bit of base building. Oh my god. Couple of rooms on the base. Where are you going? Think you could just kick me and run away? That's not how it works, bucko. Yeah. <laughs> and flying to chase him down feels really, really nice. More plasma? Hmm. Got quite a bit. But like I said, it's gonna go. Gonna go real fucking quick. Hmm. I guess wood is what I need most of all now. Yeah, I got a lot of crystals, a lot of uh, ore. We're stacking it up. Come out of that rock, you fuck. Yeah. <laughs> Dang, I guess uh, level 23 astronaut. I don't have to worry about damage, environmental damage, at least from low oxygen. That's pretty cool. I'm an awesome astronaut. Dang. Do I just live here now? Not a bad idea. I always wanted to be a moon man. Now that I got frog feet, I guess I could be a, a top class moon man. I really enjoy this game. It is a bit grindy and uh, somewhat monotonous once you get all the stuff down. But there's a lot more planets to visit, a lot more levels to gain. And I think that's uh, that's largely the point. I might take a little break uh, and at least off camera grind up some levels for the other jobs and whatnot. And then I can unlock some more blueprints. There's only a couple more vehicles left to get, but one of them is like a, a gun bomber ship thing, which sounds fucking awesome to me. I really want to check that out. So we're almost uh, stacked up on ore here. Or wood. We've been stacked up on ore for quite a while. But I'm also seeing some uh, some fossils around that I might want to go hit up just real quick. And I'm super impressed by uh, how long my, my oxygen's lasting. I used to have to use those little oxygen tanks, but no more. It seems like that's all over for me now. And I can just stay on the moon as long as I want. Or maybe this is like a different different moon with different hazards on it or something like that. That's probably the answer. I probably do need the oxygen tank still. Which is good, because I got a couple. And I'm going to stack up as much wood as possible. I need all of this. Yeah, boy. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. That's looking pretty nice. At least 1,200 of everything. So let's waste some of it. Yeah! Yeah, boy! Flav of Flav! And I think that's where I gotta go if I wanna get home. And I kinda wanna get home. Cause this is, uh, not doing me any favors. Unless I start shooting a bunch of shit. But I ain't gonna bother with that. We had a good time on the moon. Got all the shit that I needed. Thank you so much, Desolate Moon. I can't remember which one it is. Doesn't matter. Back to Suscaron. Baboosh. Ah, home again. Home again. Jiggity jog. I'm gonna take my doom buggy out for a spin. We are a little bit low on organics. But I miss my doom buggy. I worked so hard to get it. That I want to make sure that I got it. And I'm gonna drive back over to this, uh, massive, horrible place. Did you see that? I killed a boss monster. <laughs> Ooh. Dang. And this doom buggy has a boost, too. I can use it to cover more ground most quickly. Although it does burn plasma. I got a lot of plasma at the moment, but, uh... It might not last so long if I keep boosting. This runs on, oh yeah, organics. Which I'm kinda low on. I don't have the composter, um, composter blueprint 
Yeah, that's what it is. So I'll have to look for that for just a little bit longer. And uh, could you let me in here? C could I come in here? Yeah, there we go. God damn. I don't know what was happening there. But I got plenty of uh, ammo for my remodeler. And I guess we'll remodel some of this place. Yeah. Like so. And it gave me such trouble earlier in past episodes that uh, I want to come back and see exactly what the deal is. How deep does this place go? You're gonna give me some answers. Reload. That's right. You're all dead. Ooh, and that funky soundtrack is back. Leave my Vendroid alone. God damn it. Can never save them. They're just so squishy. I want to find a, a big fella. There's a big fella right there. Hey, big fella. Come on over here. Say hi to your friend Dayton. Is he, is he going to say hi? I guess he is. Give me that. I need the blueprint. A harvest booster. That's nice. I'm gliding around this place pretty good with uh, the feet from the ploppets. Fantastic. I think I did explore this wing just a little bit. But I want to see if any new boss monsters have spawned. And if I could get some more pets, that would be uh, even more wonderful. Oh, oh, oh. Miasmatic Guardian. Is he gonna come through the door? Does he know how doors work? I guess not. Oh shit! He doesn't need to know how doors work. Alright. This is what I do. Ow, 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 ow. Get that stem. Gotta take this guy down first. Boom. Boom! You're fucking dead! These guys are so difficult. They got a big brain. A suit of doom. There we go. Not so hard. After all. I could put some harvesters in here, but I've got a pretty good amount of element X. What I was hoping for most of all was uh, just a boss. I want to find a boss somewhere. Oh god. Do not lick. Licking not allowed. You're like a therapy dog, okay? Therapy dogs are not allowed to lick, in case you weren't privy to that. If your dog licks, he can't be a therapy dog, because uh, it's like unsanitary. You take your dog in the hospital, and they start licking people, people gonna be upset. Oh my god. Did you guys fucking catch a clue? Yeah! Saved everyone! You're welcome, in advance! Okay. I guess there's uh, not any big boss monsters aside from that one. Hmm. That's a disappointment. I was so sure that there was going to be like a shit ton of awesome stuff in here. There was not. Oh, there's one. Way up there. Spindlemont the Filmmaker. Be dead now. Be dead now. Oh, Jesus. That's quite terrifying. Got a few bad boys. Oh, and it is another big boss monster. And he killed a Mr. Vendroid. Why do you do this? Oh, God. At least those spitballs aren't killing me the way they were. They were fucking me up before. Where'd that big boy go? He glitched through the stairs and disappeared forever? That seems to happen more often than I would like. Hello! I'm a consumer! Hmm. Seems to be it. They had that one boy, but uh, he's gone. Oh no, there he is. 
Uh, can you die, please? He's not the same. He's a different guy. Did he, did he die? No. The little one died. The fat one still remains. Isn't that the way it is? Didn't have shit for me anyways. Well, another uh, drone pet, I suppose, would do me just fine. I don't really need anything else from here. Just uh, proving to myself that I could do it. Yes, I can do it. And now I'll hop back in my, uh, my doom buggy. We'll head back to the base. Oh yeah, boy. Hit the boosters. Ah! Oh my god. I'm sure it's a tree that hasn't loaded in yet. And another one. Please load in, trees. I really need you. Okay, thank you so much. <laughs> yeah, that's uh, kind of an issue with early access games, but I really, really like Grav. I think it has a ton of potential. And I hope that you've enjoyed it so far as well, friends. I'll grind it out a little more, uh, get the rest of these jobs up to level 30 or whatever, and then we can continue with the series because uh, I do want to check out those quote-unquote low-level planets that are beating the shit out of me. But uh, I don't want to have to put you guys through that. I've uh, showed lots of what I got to show, and I do enjoy this game a lot. I hope you do as well. Don't forget to like, comment, and or subscribe if you did enjoy, and uh, we'll be back with it relatively soon, friends. I've been Brandon Dayton, your humble narrator. Thank you so much for watching, and uh, I'll thank you for those like, comments, and or subscriptions. And how will I thank you? I'll send you a bottle of lime juice. It doesn't go bad, uh, but you probably want to refrigerate it first, because it's more delicious that way. Or you could just add it to something. It's kind of weird to just drink lime juice, but I ain't gonna judge you. It's whatever, man. <laughs> Anyways, thanks once again. Uh, I'll see you in the next one, friends. And until then, bye bye. One, two, three, four. Goodbye, goodbye. See.